if you have family who's not crazy about the fermented taste, you know, it is a um, acquired taste. So my recommendation is instead of over fermenting it or waiting until the flavors get really strong, start feeding it to your family. Um, you know, the first few times you make it, only leave it out and let it ferment for one day. No, it's not going to have as many good health uh, benefits to it. But if your family doesn't eat it, it doesn't get them any health benefits anyways. So just let it ferment for one day and then put it in the fridge and serve it to them like that for a while. And then the next time you make it, maybe try two days and see how that goes. Eventually your body gets to where it is craving the goodness of the, the probiotics and the enzymes and the acids and all the wonderful things in a lacto-fermented food and you really start to crave it. It really just starts to taste good all of the sudden. But you do need to go ahead and get it into your system a couple of times for that to happen. So go ahead and try kind of giving it to your family as a salad, maybe a cabbage salad, and don't mention that it was left out on the counter for a couple days to ferment. <laughs> so take care, you guys. Enjoy. Hey, if you're concerned about knowing whether this is good or bad after you've had it in the refrigerator for a few weeks, go ahead and watch my video on how to know if your sauerkraut has gone bad. It's really very simple. Take care, you guys. Enjoy and be healthy this winter.